Welcome to Beyond Edinburgh. I'm here in Midlothian and I'm here at the snowboarding centre, the ski slope at Hill End. And I'm here for a special reason, and that is to show you about the new complex that they're building right next door, which is going to have an airplane coaster. Now, I'm looking forward to this because you see them on holiday abroad, people look like they're having fun. And I think this will be a really good attraction here to visit once it's all done. It'll definitely get the visitors in to this uh, complex because right now, no one really comes here apart from obviously the diehard people. And I think the attraction that's going to be coming here is going to be a massive impact to the community. People are going to love it, especially kids, because it's got obviously some kids activities and all that too, zip lines as well, which I'm kind of looking forward to. So we're going to get the drone up. We're going to have a real look about. But before we do that, check out some of the construction still going ahead. They've got the diggers here. I mean, I can see the facility right at the back but I can't really see much from this bit. I'm guessing this bit here will be the car park. So let's get the drone up. Let's see this uh, new coaster. Uh, I'm looking forward to this one. Okay, now we're up. We're up in the air. Right, as you can see, there's still a lot of construction still going on. I'm guessing this area here will be the car park. This looks like here that will be the car park. They're still building it. You can see here by the steps, it's going to be on a slope. Now I can't see the main facility yet, but I can see like here they started building some of the foundations and putting up the framework for the ride itself, which is the coaster. But I can't see the facility itself. And I'm going to put a picture on the screen just now to show you what it's meant to look like when it's finished. So this is planned to open in October, rumoured. I don't know if it's true, but at this stage I wouldn't say they're ready. Now if we go further, let's look at this coaster. Let's go and have a look at this coaster. Now they're still laying the tracks just now. They're not quite finished it. You can see here this middle section in front of you is where the return coaster will go after people have used it. So then it'll go all the way up here to the top. That's not finished yet. Yeah, that section's there, not finished. So there, this section's here, not finished. Still a lot to do. Max altitude reached. I mean, there's still... There's still lots to do, but after this is complete, it's going to be a great in addition to here in Midlovian. People should come and visit this place more often, and if people visit this, they might head to the ski slope. There's the ski slope. I did do skiing when I was in school, and I did do it from the top. It is very, very scary. And there's a the complex there. The ski slope complex just there. And this is where we are, we've got Edinburgh just in front of us. You've got Arthur Seat just there, and you can probably see Edinburgh Castle in the distance. So it is beyond Edinburgh. Let's see if we can get a wee bit closer. So this is like the loop to loop. And you can see some of the safety netting that's going around there. I'm looking forward to having a go on this. I hope there isn't any weight restrictions. But so cool. This is definitely going to be a great addition here in Edinburgh. Definitely. This used to be, this here used to be a golf course, but it shut down. I used to play this golf course with my dad, but not anymore, unfortunately. It's a shame.
Yeah, but you can let me know in the comments what you think. Are you excited for this complex opening? And if it is going to be in October, they've got a lot of work still to do. Still got to lay the track, put up the zip line, if they are putting a zip line up. So we're going to come down a wee bit further here to see a wee bit closer. And you can see some of the groundwork there. And you can see the track here. It looks a long way up from here, doesn't it? Yes, how cool is that, ladies and gentlemen? And there's a walker just up there. So remember, just beyond this is Pentland Hills. But, absolutely. A beautiful view you'll have when you visit this place. But I don't see this complex being finished by October. I didn't even see its foundations. Like, where is this meant to go? Like, you've got the original one there. This one's been here for years. And you've got this two, three ski slopes, and you've got the child one here for practicing. The one on the right is the one, the main one that people use if they're not a beginner. The one on the middle, the one in the middle, is for people who are just learning. You used to come here during your school holidays and trips after school and they used to take you up there. And then the one, this wee one here on the left hand side, is a new one they put in. But yeah, you can let me know what you think of this new complex. Let me know in the comments, are you looking forward to it? What do you think? But I'll keep you up to date. I'll do another video in the future to see if the progress is uh, coming along nicely. But I think we'll bring the drone back. As I said, there's still seven months to go before this complex is even finished. There's still a lot of work to do, but it's going to be a great addition when it's finished. This coaster and the zip lines, if it's true, if the zip lines do go in, I can't wait for that to happen. You've obviously got the ski centre there, so if you want to visit that, it's here at the hill end. I'll leave all the details in the description below. But yeah, this is beyond Edinburgh and it's absolutely fantastic. Pentland Hills is just beyond there as well. So if you want to visit Penton Hills, if you're a walker, but you can walk this route as well. There's a walking route right next to it as well. So lots of things to do. I will keep you up to date in a couple of months time. I'll come back, film another video. Let me know in the comments if you want to know information. You'll probably get other vloggers here too, or the theme park vlog vloggers, like Theme Park Worldwide, one of the biggest ones on YouTube just now. He'll probably come here and want to try this coaster. So everybody can come and it can open the world up to hell end because it doesn't get used as much as what it should do and I'm surprised it's even still going but it's a fantastic location guys, fantastic location but I'm going to end the video there uh, as I say, we're beyond Edinburgh so thank you for watching, subscribe to the channel hit the thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one my friends take care, bye bye